The West Fargo City Commission has approved bonds to build a new fire department headquarters. Valley News Team's Nishe Taylor joins us now live in studio to tell us why commissioners say this is so necessary. Nishe? See, Justin, last year the West Fargo Fire Department responded to more than 2,500 calls for service within the city. But most of those calls were in the area where the new fire headquarters is set to be built. It's currently being served by a station on the other side of town, which only has five full time firefighters. Now, the West Fargo Fire Department splits the city into six planning zones. Zone one is where the new HQ will be built. It sits just south of Main Avenue and stops at Fargo city limits. This this area is considered the oldest part of the city and fire officials say the zone includes a large elderly community and low income housing. Fire Chief Dan Fuller says this area isn't getting the response times it needs. We knew that we had to get full time firefighters into this area. It's a time from when the alarm goes off to they're in the truck leaving. You know, we try to keep that to 60 to 90 seconds as much as we can. but. The travel time is where it really gets us and we can't we can't control the travel time. Chief Fuller says the department is aiming to get response times for fire calls down to the national average of five minutes and 20 seconds. Stacy, Justin. Hey, thanks so much, Nashe. The new fire headquarters is scheduled to open next summer. Meanwhile